And so what we want to do is get a list of all of the image, image file names that are within this folder. And we can actually use a list comprehension to do this. Um, a list comprehension uh, is a really powerful structure, um, uh, or it's a way of populating a list within Python. And so a list is just a, um, a it's kind of just like a set of objects. So like I could have a list of numbers, I could have a list of strings, um, etc. Um, and so what a list comprehension is doing is it's saying for every, so we're using the OS module right here, we're saying for every image within this test image folder, we want to place that as an element within the list if it doesn't have this string within the file name. <coughs> um, so this can be written much less compactly as a for loop. Uh, it's doing the same thing. So I could always say for fn and os.lister. So this is another good thing about Python, I mean Sublime. It's predicting what I'm gonna type, so it makes it a lot easier. Um, so I could, uh, until I do something like that, there we go, image folder path. Um, I could then say, write an if statement, if es store is, then I would need to, so this is an alternative way to write this, I could say. I would have to define, initialize this list first, and then I would have to append fn. So this is an alternative way of writing it. Um, so, uh, can I add something? Yeah? These are things basically, I think we all told you to have a look into Code Academy and the basic course on Python, and that actually would make you understand what is actually happening right there, right now. It's easy to understand why there are these brackets and so on. Yeah, yeah I w highly recommend co doing Code Academy. That's actually how I learned how to do Python, was through the Code Python Code Academy course.